Here is a quick overview of type for After Effects. So this first button is going to animate your text being typed out. This next button is going to add a blinking cursor to your text. Now you can select this layer and then customize the cursor however you want. Next, you can make your text flow up. So I just clicked that button, and now if I play this back, you can see that the text flows up instead of down. The highlight, underline, and strike through features all work the same. So you can select a range of text and then press one of those buttons and you'll get that effect. Or if you select a range, you can hold shift and press one of those buttons and that's gonna automatically animate it for you. You can press this button here and that's gonna remove any of the effects associated with your text. Next, you can create a box around your text and that is gonna automatically conform to any changes in your text automatically. If you wanted a static box instead, you could hold shift and click this. And then you might wanna use this for a track mat and now you have a perfect track map for your text. You can split your text into multiple layers with this button, and so that's gonna make each word its own layer, and now you can freely move those around. Or if you wanted to separate each line, you could hold Shift and click that button, or you could hold Command Shift, and that's gonna separate each character into its own layer. If you're working with numbers, you can press this button, and that's gonna create a number rig. You can keyframe this number right here, and that's gonna automatically add all the formatting you need for your number. So you can change this thousand separator to whatever you want. If you want decimals, you can add decimals here, and then you can also customize that decimal separator. You can add symbols and do a bunch of other things, but I won't get into all those right now. If you wanna add a counter, you can press this button, and that's gonna automatically animate a counter based on the time of your text layer within the comp. You can go up here and change all of these settings, and if you wanted it to count down, you could give it a start time, and then change this to a negative value. And that's gonna count down. Now this text is pretty wobbly because it's not monospaced. So you can press this button and that's gonna make any text monospaced regardless of the font. And then over here, you can control the spacing. That is type for After Effects. Hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Until next time, take care.